What up, morning guys? Welcome back to a Monday. We are up and at it super early. It is heyday. The only time to get work done on the farm is early in the morning before it gets too hot. Horses are already locked out. They're unhappy about it. They wanted to eat the hay. What? I love that idea. Look at it. They're going around. They're completely blocked off, but they are wanting the food. They want in. Look at them. All right, come on, come in. I have a feeling Lady would like water. You want to go to the beach? So he wants to take the horses to the beach. You can't take horses to the beach during beach season, though. All right. It's a Monday morning, and the girls are up at the crack of dawn. Never happens in the summer, but haying is different, you guys. What? Sophie's afraid of these these floors, for goodness sake. All right, in the way. These are like different. Does this go sideways? Yeah. The animals can hear us up here, and they're everybody's just screaming. Look at the roof, though. Isn't that like gorgeous? It's so gorgeous. Teamwork makes the dream work. Also known as keeps our animals fed for the winter. She can't walk. Sylvie, it's fine. Some of them are weak. They're all fine. Don't tell her some are weak. Are you silly? It looks like we're not going to be camping out in here anytime soon. We are filling up with hay pretty darn fast. Come here, Boos. Come here, Boosie Pig. Come on. Come here, Boosie. Come on, baby. Why can't she come in here? Come here, Posey. Come see Mama. <laughs> come on, run. Remember when you used to do zoomies when you were a baby and now you're a lazy girl? Come on, baby. Come here. <laughs> come here, yeah. All right, so that's weird. Now I found a bracelet. This says horses. I'm pretty sure that's my kids though. I'm pretty sure I gave it to Brooklyn. Hi, oh, babe. You like it in here? Yeah. Sophie, my pig just, you have to squat down. Squat down. Squat down or she'll be afraid. I love touching the pig. Gabby, you like bacon. <laughs> Gabby loves bacon. Like eating bacon not, <laughs> not playing with bacon. <laughs> we would never eat you. No. You're going to learn. She says she can't stack hay. You're about to learn, sister. How about you stop being like a silent observer? A silent observer? Listen, there's nothing silent about me. I see how this is gonna go. <laughs> Poor baby, princess. Oh, you do I'm gonna help right now. I just like watching you do it. Dad and I did the whole thing the other day. Yeah, yeah. oh and Sophie. I have to take lots of breaks because, yeah, so, so this is like, he has another load to do today and then there's another two loads that he's going to do in a, in a few weeks. Oh, you're waking up early, sister. The earliest I'm waking up is 12. 
All right, everybody comment below. Do you think? And Dad, you can't wake me up like that. I didn't even hear what you were saying. Yeah, you have to make sure she's awake before you start talking. If you want coffee, you better get up. And go get it. That's all I heard. I said, if you want coffee, you better get up and go get it. Yeah, I didn't hear that. When I get back oh, here, I'll have it. She's really annoying when she wants me to be talking. She's really annoying when she has to work. <laughs> Only when she has to do manual labor. Gabby's not a manual labor kind of girl. So bad. <laughs> it hurts so bad. It just hurts, you guys. So we're at 85 bales. Sam's gonna go get another one today. We're gonna be at, we're gonna be at like we're gonna at this we're gonna we're getting about 350 bales. That's the end story. Why don't you wear your riding gloves or any kind of gloves? Because I didn't think of it, and I don't know where they are. Well, you have lots of time to go find them while Dad loads up the trailer again. There's another load. Yeah. <laughs> My back is really bad. I'm old and I have a bad back. I'm like literally the biggest worker I used to always be. Just certain things I can't do. <laughs> yeah, Gabby says there are certain things that she can't do too. And hers are anything physical that requires physical labor. I feel like my yeah, pig is scratching exactly. up against my leg. But I, ever since my back got bad, like just this year actually, just oh, this winter, yeah. I find it really hard to carry anything in the front of me. If I have to carry things, on my, by my side, like on my arm, I can do that. But to okay. lift things above my shoulders, I can't Watch do. This is, going, <laughs> this is going. Hopefully going up there. It's not going up there, I just realized that. Yeah, come on, you caught it, you caught it. Come on everybody, cheer her on. You oh. caught it, you caught it, you can do it. <laughs> you did it. I mean, it, it, you did it. <laughs> She's been attacked by hay. <laughs> you did it. <laughs> That's a nice one. This is clearly way more go hay than we need for the goats. Yeah, there's gonna be a shortage. But not nearly enough for the, for the horses. We're doing round bales again for the horses. And then this will just be extra. All right, that is it for this load. Sam's coming back with another load of another 45 or however many he can fit in the trailer. And then after that, uh, we're waiting for a couple of weeks until we get the rest of it. Come here, you silly pig. Come on. I don't want any flattened pigs. Come on, this way. Uh-oh. Oh, she's leaving. Come here, baby. Come here. Just stay here, you need a collar. Is it humane to put a collar on a pig? Because she needs a collar. Yeah, you stay here while they drive out. Gabby's on, Gabby and Sophie are on gate duty and I'm on pig duty. How do I tell when the beans, or when the peas are done or the beans? The beans. Oh, they're done. They're, the only reason I kept them is because there's a few small ones. I had a lot of beans this year. Look, there's little baby bees. Yeah, they're good still. Lots of, see these things are, the tiny little skinny things aren't full yet. Like that one you could eat. I don't eat beans. Mm, I eat beans. So good for you. They're just, what is that? That's one, that's good. That's good. Why are you picking them if you're not gonna eat them? Because they have a cool texture. You like the texture? Yeah, they're like fuzzy. They are like fuzzy. Who's this? This is so that's a dried up one. You can use that, dry it out, dry the seeds out and grow them next year. All right, we are back at it again, you guys. It is gonna be bonkers this year. I was just talking to my friend and she was like, yeah, like, hey, it's either gonna be so expensive this year or you're not gonna be able to find it. Right there, right there. They're counting blisters, you guys. My oh poor my children. <laughs> 
counting their blisters. They have such a hard life. Gabby has none. I have two. Sophie has two. I just want to say oh, that haying is a lot easier when you're not bent in half in a law. All right, Sophie, trade with Gabby now. Okay, so I'm going to take a picture. We still have two more, 200 more bales to pick up, but I'm going to take a picture of the family in front of the hay bale. The girls are like, we don't need a picture. And I'm like, we do, because one day when you guys are all grown up and you live in a city and you have no animals. I'm never moving to the city. I know, me neither, man. And so Gabby is. And your kid, your computer geek kid, says you used to be on a farm and then I can show them this picture and say yep your mama used to climb the hay bales she used to do hay <laughs> she's behind the pool it's literally noon and all the horses are already in I actually love that the horses use the barn as a shelter it's big enough that everybody can use it I think we should put some more in here too so we feed round bales but then we also feed square bales too I think most people Especially if you bring your horses in at night, you end up having to. I brought an apple for Posey and I don't see her anywhere. Give me the apple. No! Get your own apple, sister. This is for Posey. Give me the apple. You guys, something that, you know how, oops, let me just fix this. I just did Ellie's hair and I realized that she just sits here in front of me and lets me put her hair up. And when I first got her, it took like, it literally took a year before I could do that. And it was such a struggle. And now I'm just sitting here putting her hair up and realizing what a good girl she is. I need to trim some stuff though. It's getting in her eyes. Come on, Ellie Bear, let's go. All the horses are at the hay bale. We threw a bunch of new hay in there. Well, not all the horses. Who does Sophie have today? I decided I'm not gonna line drive. I'm gonna teach her a trick. You're gonna teach her a trick? So she was- go around the barrel. To go around a barrel? A block, all I really want to give Posey <laughs> uh apple, but I can't find her. I hate when that happens. What a beautiful picture though. All those beautiful colors and how the palominos are on either side. Oh, Are you laying in the shade on a comfy bed of hay? Put fresh water up for Ellie every day and she stands in the bucket. I can't. Every time I try and sit down, I get surrounded. These are the clearly the animals that appreciate me. <laughs> Here we go. Listen, gosh, maybe we can share, share. Be nice. If you're mean, you're in trouble. It's an apple. Do you like it? Oh, don't bite my fingers. Oh. When it comes to food, uh oh, let me take the tag off. Hold on. You want some? Ow, jeez Louise. <laughs> you want some? Ow, come on now. She's acting all crazy because she's got competition. <laughs> you guys, look at this. <laughs> Even the chicken is here. Let's see if I can give some to the chicken. The chicken got some. Here. Here, baby. You want to try it? You're crying for it, but you won't eat it. Do you want some cricket? It's yummy. Just for you, baby. Try it. It's yum. Oh, she might like it. She's afraid somebody's going to come and peck her. Here. You want the rest? <laughs> Tell me that that is not the best life. <laughs> where animals just come and eat food out of your hands. Go away from that one. That one's mean. From pigs to horses. Wow, I didn't realize it was going to be that good. Yeah. Yeah. Right, Barrel racing 101 with the mini. Sophie's out here every single day working with the animals. Look at that! Still a really good try. Give her a treat. That was so good. She went the wrong way. I know, but still, she's like, just learned this. Like, the horse is so good. You gotta reward effort. Okay. 
I don't know why we need to figure out how to do more with this horse because she is a freaking amazing girl. Uh oh, honey's coming. Oh, and here comes the baby, which we still haven't fixed the fence, Sam. You missed it. I missed it. She's the best at that one. She's the best at that one? All right, let's start from the fresh. What? <laughs> She's like, do it to me too. Okay, if I tried with her, she'd have her ears pinned the whole time, trying to bite you the whole time. 5 a.m. and we are in trouble. <laughs> <laughs> she did a perfect off camera and now she's like oh there's a flower <laughs> hi hi baby I love you Ellie oh All right, one last try, you guys. One last try and see if she can do it. She was doing really good, and then she's a jumper. She's not a barrel racer. She's a jumper. Horses tell you what they want to do. She's a jumper for sure. You might have to like do it with her. There we go. I mean, she's not running, but she's. Getting it. <laughs> I just edited a Sophie's riding lesson lesson and she made lots of mistakes. And is yep, and she's learning everything all fresh and new again and she did amazing and Lady did amazing. They have so much to work on. But it's amazing that they get to do it together. And they're like, you guys are like the same age. She's a year younger than you, and Finn was a year younger than you. That's like a good combination for Sophie. Sophie and I have to carry water from the barn to the duck pool. And let me tell you, it's a feat. We're good for four buckets. <laughs> That's my big white one over there. Ah. 